So, welcome to the latest in our Thought for the Week tweets. This is Blitz Week here in Coventry Cathedral. Uh, that means we've got all sorts of activities taking place during the week. We have had the events of Remembrance Weekend, we've had the Bark B Minor Mass, we've had Paul Oerstreicher speaking here on the subject of peace or justice. Can we have both? Fantastic. We've also been welcoming guests from our twin city of Kiel, and that's been a real privilege because Kiel was actually the first place to receive a cross of nails as a city from Coventry in the days really closely following the end of the Second World War. It is an extraordinary story, and I'm just going to quote for a moment from the book by Oliver Shugraff, um, former um, uh, working in reconciliation in, in the cathedral here and of course now the leader of the community of the Cross of Males in Germany. And uh, in January 1947, Kiel's newspaper published an appeal from the mayor, Andreas Geik, and he recounted the story of a British officer named Williams from Coventry who'd been stationed in Kiel. This man, whose hometown has been ruthlessly demolished by the German Luftwaffe, came to Kiel as part of Marshal Montgomery's victorious armies, to Kiel, which is one of the worst hit towns of northern Germany. Yet this man did not feel any satisfaction in seeing that the Royal Air Force had given like for like, but from the first moment did everything in his power to help a town which had shared the fate of his own native town and to alleviate the distress which he had known from his experience. The presence of Williams in Kiel and the partnership they formed led to a delegation, the Provost Dick Howard, the mayor, the leader of the trades unions, going across to Kiel with the first presentation of a cross of nails to another city and to form a partnership which abides to this day. It's an incredibly powerful witness. And I was able to visit Kiel uh, earlier on this autumn and I met somebody there um, who will be here with us in Coventry during, during this week to share in our remembrance events. And I was just admiring Kiel and the environment there with the beautiful fjords and it's a really a beautiful setting. And I said, you've got so much here. And she said, yes, but you've got the cross of nails. And frankly, which is more important? And it took me right back to our core values, that what we have to share with the world is this story of reconciliation, of hope for the future, of the key priorities of healing the wounds of history, learning to live with difference and celebrate diversity, building a culture of peace. That's our gift to the world. It's something for us to live by. They're values that call us back home to God and his work of reconciliation. They're the things that get me out of bed in the morning, and I hope that they're inspiration for you this morning. God bless you.